got the Ayrshire car again, a fourth car there. We've been shown at Balmoral for a long, long time, uh, 40 some odd years, and we're delighted today. This is the third year in a row we have won the interview. Not with this particular car, this is her first time actually at Balmoral. Um, she's normally calf for the autumn time. Um, we had been closed with TV and we weren't able to get out in December, so we kept her for today. This is our first out in Balmoral. Why did she win? Uh, she has an amazing udder and mammary system for a fourth cabin cow. It's so high and wide and so full of milk. And she just got better and better as the day went on. And it was really just the way she was able to carry the volume of milk that she gives, uh, how she looked, and she had the age over the other animals in the interview competition. Oh, I'm really, really delighted. Smile, squint, whatever. When you went to an interbreed, it's the best representative of each breed. We've been very fortunate. We've had a couple of really good cows recently. This is the third year in a row we've won it. We won it the last two years uh, with the same individual. This is a different cow. Um, we've worked hard to get the animals to the standard that they're at to compete against black and whites, red and whites. Um, so we're pretty pleased that we've managed to do it again today. It's, it really is quite an achievement to do it three years in a row. You need a good commercial base to put a bottom in the market and uh, everybody's under pressure at the moment and cash flows tight. Um, these sort of animals here don't really come on the market that often, she wouldn't be particularly for sale but uh, e even animals that we would have at home and that, um, yeah, it is slower for them to move at the present time. But there's always, uh, Jersey's actually gaining quite a bit of popularity because of their fat and protein, uh, so there's quite a bit of commercial interest in them. Um, yeah, the price is not as good as it has been in the last few years, but uh, they're still holding up relatively well compared to all the breeds.